Hey Glam Fam! Hey guys! It's my beautiful wife Allison and myself, Lynn Wood here, and today we have a wig review for you from HairVivi.com. Now you know you guys, this is going to be just really something else. They always do very good wigs, because the cap construction is always really good. I've got a surprise because I don't know what this wig looks like. <laughs> uh, this is the baggie that it came in, by the way. Which usually their boxes, I'll show you the box, but I didn't do any like fancy footage of it because the postal service was disrespectful. Um, and they, I don't know what they were doing, playing soccer with it. But you can see usually when the postal service has not done whatever, it's pa packaged very nicely. Very nicely. Reusable box, definitely. So the wig Allison has is about a chin length uh, curly wig. And uh, if you're not familiar with Hair BB, all the knots and everything are already bleached, the hairline is already tweezed, it has an elastic band in there, uh, and this is a new cap construction to help out with ensuring that it is a glueless wig. Look at that beautiful um, hair. So you're not having to worry with all that. And it's soft, you guys. Soft. Oh, it is. Usually a lot of times when you get like the wigs like that, I feel like they feel somewhat crunchy. You almost have to really yeah. get in there. Uh, that one feels nice. This dense too. Another thing that's a defining factor for Hair Vivi is they do a fake scalp method in their wigs. So on the inside, if you don't mind flipping that inside out, on the inside they have a uh, extra piece of uh, fabric right in there that mimics the look of like a stocking cap so you don't have to worry about doing a ton to prep your hair and all that. Matter of fact, I forgot to get you an elastic for your hair to be able to pull it up. Um, so I'm gonna get that if you wanna go ahead and yeah. I don't think I'll need it. You don't think so? Okay, we'll play it by ear. Now they are promoting a new cap construction, so let me go ahead and show you guys what the cap construction looks like here. This is in a lighter color, but that way you can more easily see. So their old cap construction was the same cap through here, but the uh, sideburn area really was not, um, how can I put it? The sideburn area wasn't reinforced at all. And so a lot of times it would have a glueless application here, but if the wind blew or something, you would still easily lift around the sides. Um, so what they did is they went ahead, for those that are wondering, the green part is where the hairline would typically be if you can see that green in there. But what they did is they installed these little tabs in here so you can bend it and shape it and hold to your facial shape a bit more. And that way it holds rigid and nice and firm for you so you're not having to worry about all that. So I don't know if you can see where I went ahead and bent that tab and it's kind of keeping that shape there. It's to help it hold secure. That would be on both sides. On the inside of the cap, um, it has the elastic band as usual and it is adjustable so you can adjust it to the tightness that you need and it is removable so if you don't like it you don't have to keep it so you're able to do all of that in there and now they've also added in the nape they've got like these little tabs in here that are like a silicone material to help kind of grip at the hairline without uh, being too tight or anything like that it's not super super grippy um, it's weird it almost feels like a fusion between silicone and tape um, yeah. It has a light stick, but it's not like super grippy. And then of course you have the adjustment bands in there as with most other wigs where you can still adjust and get it to feel more fitted and all that. And that goes into little tabs that are right there in the nape. So all of that is in here, plus the fake scalp method, which they didn't include on this because obviously there's no hair on this cap, but just so that way you can see. And then there's a goodie bag. Yes, they also a goodie have bag. goodie bag. These bags are so sexy. They are just so sexy. I'm telling you, you can pack your overnights and stuff in them. In the goodie bag, we have a rat tail comb, an edge brush. Ooh, ah, by now you've probably seen one of those before. Um, a silicone band. And so that way, if you need to uh, have it a bit more secure and you're not wanting to use any type of adhesive, which we won't be doing in this video today, uh, you're able to use that to get a little added grip. So you can lock that wig down. <laughs> yes, lock it down. We got some clips in here to hold your hair out of the way or to be able to pin the hair back while you're styling. And then from there, a pair of tweezers in case you wanted to do any additional adjustments, things like that to the wig. And the tweezers just so happen to match the goodie bag. Um, it's, I don't know, it's so weird to me. Details like that always stand out. All right, you ready? I think I'm so. I'm ready, you ready? Yes. I'm ready, all right. Let's see. I'm, done. I'm trying to figure out what you're planning on. Okay, put your hand right there. Oh, okay. Oh, let me use one of these. Uh, okay, look at God. Mm -hmm. So right now I'm just here. <laughs> As you, as, you know, it's like, it's like it always says with these videos. I'm just here for comic relief and shenanigans as per usual. And Allison is here to slay. So let me go ahead. I'm going to zoom y'all in just a smidge. <laughs> and we're I've never used one of these before. So I'm pretty like uh, looking crazy. If you're like, ah, oh, you do this and then, oh, wait a minute. So yeah, I guess that's on. I've got the nape pulled up and everything. I've got my hair 
picked up. Alright, well. Alright, so I've already did my adjustments on the wig. I have a really small head, so I don't, I don't think I'm gonna need much going on. Let me adjust this one a little bit. Trying to figure out what the plan is back here. You what? just you just hold your roll. Okay, I, my roll is hell. <laughs> my roll is hell. I'm gonna butter it too. Get in here. <laughs> Let me know when you want me to go get that elastic hair tie for you. Look, look like a party's about to start, huh, y'all? <laughs> Bam! <laughs> Everything except to get a ponytail holder. <laughs> Everything but to get a ponytail. <laughs> yeah, you're probably gonna have to slide that band back some because it's visible through your lace. Okay, hold on just a second. You know, you'd be trying to remove your whole forehead when you do this stuff. Not the whole thing. I like to, to use those cones too. Those cones are so helpful. Oh, the ones in the nape and stuff? Yes. Yeah, especially with that silicone band, I would imagine, because then it would help to catch up underneath there. But even if you're not using that, you can just place them up under the elastic band. Mm -hmm. Is she asymmetric? Is that what I'm seeing? This, this has got so many different vibes to it, and it's so soft and pretty. And uh, Harlem Nights and Harlem Nights, mm -hmm. that, that's the one where they shot off old girl pinky toe. Yep, I okay. can't. That's right. So, you guys can see this is literally straight out. We haven't even trimmed the lace, so like it's blending really nicely with her skin. Um, because like on camera, from what I'm seeing anyway, I mean, I'm a good distance away, but on camera, it's really looking like you've already trimmed lace off of there. Um, so yeah. So this is literally straight out the pack, right on her head. You guys can see what's going on. There you go. I just pushed it back a little bit. Ooh, ah, ooh, the wild gazelle. So we're ready to trim? Yes, we're ready to trim the lace line. You gonna take it off for that or you wanna do it? Oh, one? I gotta take it off for that. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> I ain't trying to lay something. I mean, on honestly, your hair is not prepped underneath. They're not on a wrist and cutting something that ain't supposed to be cut. So, you know. Okay, so that's just taking out, throwing it off. Uh, to trim the lace on here, we're just gonna go ahead and cut it nice and close to where the hairline is already between that. Um, so just so you guys can see up close on the hairline, she's already tweezed. Little bitty knots in through there, already bleached. Fake scalp method already there. I mean, it's it's a superior wig, I will say. And that's one thing I absolutely love about Hair BB is even in instances where I've seen people have complaints and stuff in the comment section, they've gone through and like responded and tried to adjust their wigs to ensure that they're giving you what you're looking for so you're not having to put so much work into it, which is nice. Aw, uh, thank you. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and trim off this excess lace and we'll be back. And we're back, and Alize Jenkins has decided to actually go ahead and get some bobby pins, so look at God. Uh, so she's just gonna pin this hair up, nothing special. Um, I mean, a lot of times, if you wanted to wear it like for a long, periodically time, you would wanna go ahead and do like uh, some braids or something like that. It doesn't have to be anything super intricate, um, but you do want it to be pretty flat underneath, just so you're not giving cone head status, cause that's not cute. Anything you wanna add to that commentary? Nope. <laughs> I'm gonna close this door because your child be listening to me at the volume of Wild Lord. Okay, so so far my job here has been to trim the lace. Um, and Allison honestly <laughs> could have done that. I'm just trying to find any purpose for my life right now, you know? Um, but that's okay. I mean, Allison is, is totally able to handle these type of videos, but I'm basically like her security blanket. <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like everything. I just feel like everything wants to just flip flop. You know, you don't wear a wig for three days and you don't know what you're doing no more. I tell you. <laughs> well, it's a good thing you don't have to do all that gluing and stuff. Then. <laughs> okay, get my cones up under there. Child, I'm liking this already. I mean, it's curly. I'm not gonna have to stand behind you with a flat iron. I can just sit here and bask in the ambience. I can just appreciate the beauty from a distance. I don't have to like be all in here styling and stuff. Right. And she's on. She's on. Okay, I'm gonna zoom y'all in so you can see she just threw it on. No styling or anything, as you can see. Just, just <laughs> on. Boop. Hey y'all, my name is Alize Jenkins. On my free time, I love to go ahead and write books about how people who cross me need to get slapped in the voice. So, 
anyway, y'all make sure to buy my new book. It's called I'll Slap a Hoe. Available at bookstores near you. She's an offer now, y'all, for real though, honestly. We'll, we'll talk to y'all more about that in the future. Okay, I'm liking the shape. She's she's giving, she's giving, okay. Well, let me pull this up a little bit and let's zoom y'all out some, okay. Well, I gotta get that, uh, what's her name? Uh, what people say I look like all the time? A Shaka Khan? Shaka Khan, I gotta give that Shaka Khan vibe. I'm telling you, people be saying you look like everybody. <laughs> everybody. <laughs> I mean, so you guys can see, like, no hairspray, no gel, no mousse, no nothing. Like, literally straight out the pack. Um, so I like big hair. Honestly, no styling product. Austin does like big hair, so, yeah. yeah. I like it big. I, I wanted to say something without me having to say a word. You wanted to say, back up! <laughs> you need to uh, have them start putting a sign on there that says, no, you can't touch it. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, so in terms of ease, this is this is nice. I mean, like, take it right out the pack, put it on there. That does it feel secure and all that to you? Yeah. Okay. Now I'm gonna get into a cat fight with it, but you know. Let me see here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and bend that in just a smidge. Look, y'all. I'm trying to find <laughs> I'm telling you. So yeah, so if you're one of those that's just like, I don't know what to do with this, I can't be trying to do all of this, laying and and, and all of that type of stuff, I'm just trying to look crude. Like, you know, especially if you're one of those that's been like, you know, maybe I should just do a headband wig, maybe I should do something else, maybe I should just wear my own hair out, but I don't want to deal with it. Like, you know, whatever the case may be, now you have some options. Options are always nice. Um, we'll put all the information that you need down. This for y'all young box. people right here, how y'all young people be doing it? That, not with that. That poodle puff uh -uh. right there. Not with that. No, she didn't just do the pebbles. Not the pebbles. <laughs> you know how y'all be doing. If it's not a bun right here, Girl, it's something else. You know our audience is mature, sophisticated folk. They not. They not them young people who wearing that. They do be wearing a poncho right here. Not our audience. Not using this gator, but <laughs> y'all see that right there. The mother ones don't do you like that. Look at that. Hold on, I'm gonna zoom. I'm gonna zoom. Look at that. Bam! It don't do you like that. I ain't did nothing. I ain't had to pluck. I ain't had to hurt my hand on no tweezers. There you go. You got side effects and everything. Side effects or sound effects? Sound effects. Because a right. side effect is not something you want. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we still getting COVID vaccines and stuff. We don't need no side effects. Hold up. Okay, I, I can't. I can't take you seriously with this. This is gonna have to go. Mm. Haterade. I said, yeah. <laughs> you feeling it more that way? Of course. She always wears her hair part that Oh, way. I guess I do, huh? Um, all that being said, I mean, honestly, I don't really feel like there's much else for us to say. We've done so many reviews for Hair Beauty, but there will be a discount code in the description box down below. There will be links to this wig and their website in the description box down below, as well as a bunch of other stuff that you can check out. Um, if you haven't seen some of their other wigs, feel free to look through some of our other tutorials. We've done several different units with Hair BB, and I will say the only thing that seems to have changed in terms of quality is the things that they do to make it easier for the wearer, um, yeah. which I appreciate, especially like obviously the blend on this one is HD lace. It's not your standard lace. Um, so it just blends effortlessly with the skin. That was one of their more recent uh, changes that they did to their caps before this one. Now they've got the tabs to help hold it secure around the sides. Uh, they so just keep can, on improving on top of perfection. Yeah, I mean, next they're gonna send it with a stylist in the box. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what they're gonna do next. But, um, I mean, honestly, Hair Vivi, I know you're listening. Um, the only thing that I've heard people discuss is that they would love if this was somehow perforated to where they could just whoop and pull it right off and not have to do any cutting. So if you got a way to do that, I'll at your boy, let me know. Um, <laughs> Cause I mean, I, that's the only thing I was in this whole video for. That's the whole, that's my whole purpose in existing. And you guys just keep in mind, I didn't put no product on this. I didn't wet it, mousse it, hairspray it. I didn't do anything. I'm telling you, I just feel like it needs more right there. Right now, it's giving me it's giving me Willy Wonka because you did all this pulling on the sides and nothing <laughs> in the top. Okay. I, I massaged it in the top like this, but I don't know. I, I like this hair. This hair texture is beautiful. This is just like one of those um, 
my, like my Creole grandma hair, that, that <laughs> wavy, soft. She didn't had it braided all night and just undid it, you know. Cute. Mm -hmm. Wait, which grandma? Cute. Was my grandma Proctor. Oh, I thought she was gonna say pig mama because all grandma I could hear was Proctor. them swamps. You like swamps, Lambwood? <laughs> yeah, I love me some swamps. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have anything else to say. Um, I don't either. I mean, I mean, it's you guys tell us what you think about this. If this is something that you think you could uh, get, and you know, how would you wear it? Yeah, give them the full spin. Give them. Let them see. Oh, I know the chair. Won't I know, just like so. Just turn and then turn your head so that they can see the shape in the back. So this is the shape in the back. Like honestly, even the shape of it, because I will say, Bob's Allison has the worst luck with Bob's for some reason. They never fit just right on her head shape and all that. And this is stacking nicely. Like this is like you should see the back. I'm gonna have to show you the playback of the video because um, it's nice. It's it's very nice. Hair BB, y'all did the doggone thing. But I mean, we're not surprised, honestly. Because I remember, Laura, the first time that we did a wig review for Hair BB, Allison was like, ah! <laughs> um, so, yeah. We've consistently liked their stuff. They've consistently done good work. Child, why the camera gave out right as we were trying to tell y'all bye? So we came back just to say hi, just to say bye all over again. So until next time, you guys, take care. God bless. Stay glam. You know we love you, boo. And don't forget to check out the description box and the top pin comment for information and details that you may like, including discount codes for this wig mm -hmm. and so much more. Y'all stay tuned for the announcement because as I said, I'll say Jenkins here is an author. Holly go, shout about Coco. We'll tell you more about that. Um... I've got some business ventures going on. We'll tell you more about that too, but not in this video because that's not what this is for. So until next time, Caleb, you bye. <laughs>